Today marks not only the 30th anniversary of Back to the Future, it's also the exact date that Marty and Doc travel to when they go to the future in Back to the Future 2. We're in the future! On Wednesday, October 21st, 2015! But if you look around today, you don't see a world filled with hoverboards, flying cars, and fast reflexes, and a lot of people feel like the 2015 of today is not as magical as the one predicted almost 30 years ago. So to celebrate, I want to see how far we've really come by traveling back to the past and living my day like it's the 1980s. Everything was totally tubular until my boss handed me the name and number of someone I needed to call. That meant I had to find a phone that was connected to a landline. I searched the building extensively and, to my surprise, came up empty-handed. So I ventured out to find a payphone. As I stood there defeated, I realized that living in the past is no way to celebrate today. It was time for me to go back to the future. Today should be about celebrating how far we've come in 30 years. We may not yet have flying cars, but we have portable computers that bring us limitless information at our fingertips. Smart devices entertain us and connect us anywhere, instantly to people across the globe. Even this video was shot with digital cameras that record to these and edited with this, all in less than 24 hours. I even had time to take a selfie with my cameraman and share it with all of my friends. In the 1980s, not only would this have been impossible, but my entire job would not even exist. And that's what makes Back to the Future Day so special for me. Not only am I celebrating a movie trilogy that I cherish, I've developed a greater respect for just how far we've come. We've come so far that it's nearly impossible to go back. And while we're arguably over-dependent on our technology, I look forward to seeing what the next 30 years brings us. Happy Back to the Future Day.